See, the good thing about MetaMask or Binance, actually, is because they got two parallel blockchains. They made one be able to communicate with MetaMask, with Ethereum, because Ethereum's normally, MetaMask is normally for Ethereum-based tokens. But what you can do, you can go and custom, then Google just MetaMask to Binance Smart Chain. There's the link. Scroll down, and we can put this, uh, the instructions. So we're going to call it smart chain and network name could just type it in so smart chain then we want the rpc l and copy this one and to get my mask on the page because sometimes it's just a tab to just go to expanded view so it stays up there because if it doesn't if you don't do that it's just going to keep going away then we want chain id 56, because I've done this before on another site. Then we want the rest is optional. What else have we got? Block Explorer URL, but that's optional. We're going to paste it anyway. Symbol BNB. Let's copy and paste and I save. It's got a smart chain there. Now, when I go back to my MetaMask, it's showing me I've got my BNB in there. And before I can go back to Ethereum, and now I've got Binance because we want Binance to be able to set up to link to PancakeSwap to be able to provide liquidity and be able to farm to get free or our yield payments for being paid with swap tokens. And then adding tokens to your MetaMask, because right now I've only got BNB. It pretends Ethereum, but it's not really just borrowing the symbol, but it's just BNB on the smart chain. I add token and I want swap, because I'm going to pull for swap. So to make sure you get the correct address, I normally go to CoinGecko. And then I can write swap. So it's pancake swap actually. Pancake swap. Scroll. That I can add it. Click this. I can copy it. Either copy it or just click add to MetaMask. If I click add to MetaMask, it should go direct. Add token. It should be there. So I can click. This way is if I wanted to add custom token, then you copy and paste the address there. And then it would find it. So I've got my cake there as well. So I'm going to now go to Pancake Swap Exchange because I've got that two BNB, but I need a pair. So I need some cake tokens and cake. Like this week, things have been going down. So it's, it's a good time to swap for cake because cake, we can see in seven days, it's gone 43%. All time high was $20. So luckily it's like nearly 50% down from all time high. So I can swap to get cake. That is probably a good time, a good discount there. Even Binance, they're down seven thirty-two percent in seven days, but 24 hours they're going up. So and the point of staking and stuff and farming is the point. My coin's sitting there doing nothing. At least this way, if I'm still gonna hold, but instead of just holding this and you go up and down, I get to do something with them and get a dividend get annual percentage yield, get some yield payments, some interest for farming my token. So there's a use for them because with some coins, there's no use. So here I'm on the Pancake Exchange. So let me connect my wallet. So MetaMask. I've got this account. Next, connect. So I've got a max of two, I believe. connected yet yes yeah, so I've got max of two but I just want to change one so I'm going to change one and I want uh what's it called it's pancake swap isn't it so cake yeah it's called cake so how much can I get for that here we go so one 
whole BNB Binance coin you can get me 20 cake. So let me swap, confirm swap. There's a few gas fees compared to ETH, it's supposed to be much quicker. Confirm. Let's see, view on BSC scan. We're saying pending. So I might pause it. Let's see how long it takes. Because after it's done that, it would be my MetaMask wallet. So it's already taken one away. Oh, so it's ready there. So I've got 20 cake and one. Now I can go to try and farm that pair. So I'm pancake swap. So you see pancake swap finance farms. That's very quick. Now let me press connect. MetaMask. So I want this account. Connect. So that is connected yeah so i can approve contract and this has given me 128 percent apr see there's some bigger ones there but i prefer to get cake cake to cake so approve contract So I think that went to my MetaMask, see the one, so there's something that wants me to approve. So confirm a little transaction fee. And you can see it's gonna give me this cake tokens. So I'm staking now to get these tokens. So where my stake LP? Oh yeah, I think before I do that, I need to go to the pools and actually get LP tokens, isn't it? So cake, let's see. So yeah, actually from the exchange, where I exchange from buy uh, one BNB to my cake tokens, I have to go liquidity. So add liquidity. So I want my BNB, I'm gonna go with, let me click swap actually. So get the cake, so my max cake. So that max cake will need this much of BNB. So that's fine, Is it ready for supply. So I approve. See, these fees are much cheaper than Ethereum. Proven cake, let's see. Let's see if that's ready my wallet. Not yet. Oh, it changed, and so I can supply myself with LP tokens. So I will see 4.05 of the LP tokens, confirm supply. Confirm. Let's see, that's still pending. Now that's done. So if I go back here, so I can see, and I've got four cake LP. How come I've still got 1.37 BNB? Oh, 
Oh yeah, no, that's changed now. So yeah, that's done. But now, so that was changing, staking to get the LP tokens. Now to farm, so I can go back to Pancake Finance. And it's already connected. Now I can stake LP. Let me refresh it in case. So I'm gonna have to connect again, press connect. I think it's connected. Press connect. Is my address. Let me see approved contract. So stake is already there. So max I've got is this much. Confirm. Now remember, this is not financial advice, but it's about making your coins do something, getting some interest. So I've confirmed that, that's pending. And then I should, when it's all cleared, we'll be able to see how much we have staked. And you can look back in months and stuff. And you can unstake when you want. So that was very quick, actually. I didn't even need to pause it because straight away now we can see we've got this amount of stake. If you want to harvest, so when it's showing your cake earned, you can harvest it and then put that back in as well. So you get more cake into your account, swap, get more pairs of Binance and put more in as well.